Hey everybody, Everlast Smiles here, and I am playing The Sims 4 as you can see. Uh, I'm not sure if you can hear me or not, because I'm not sure if it's this microphone that it's using, or if it's the microphone on my laptop, which I have no idea where it's at. Um, so, let me know when this is posted, whether or not you can hear me, and I will switch up the microphone that I use. Um, sorry that I'm not actually live streaming, but I will be posting this without edits, so there's that. So it's kind of a live stream, except not. Regardless, I'll still be looking at every comment that is posted in the section down below to um, to try and respond to everything that you guys are telling me, whether or not you can hear me, for one, and for two, uh, how you think this is working out. I just got a brand new tablet, drawing tablet, and I'm hoping to be able to post some art videos as well as my gaming videos, just to mix things up a bit. Um, as you can tell, I've got a lot of, um, I've got almost every expansion pack except for Seasons, and I've got a few of the game and stuff packs as well. So we should be able to do some decently awesome stuff. Oh, and I also have some mods on this as, as well. So yeah, this should be fun. I added some new careers, I added a couple of um, new hairstyles to the game. And yeah, so this should be fun. have a few families in this game, uh, one of which is a vampire family, which I am very proud of. It's the Eterna family. It seems my game is being stubborn. There we go. As you can see, we got four people, two adults and two teenagers. Oh, and two babies. Now, the first time I tried to make a family out of this household uh, was not successful because I forgot to turn the game off when I closed my laptop and it was left on overnight and we ended up getting the baby taken away because of neglect. So, <laughs> oh, and that happened twice. So yeah. My bad. But now we have two teenagers, or did I make them young adults? I don't remember. But anyways, I digress. We still have two babies in the family, as well as the two teenagers, young adults, whatever. And they're all vampires. Okay, yeah, they are teenagers. So this is Onyx, the oldest uh, daughter, and then this one's Lucifer, come on, bring me to him, and he's talking with his uh, dad, um, Jax, and then there's Vera. Now, I did not come up with a specific design for these sims. I only came up with the outfits. So these sims are pretty much all just random. I randomized them until I saw something I liked and then I went from there. And then we have Blakely, 
the baby daughter, and then there's Vlad, the baby son. Like Onyx and Lucifer, Blakely and Vlad are twins. And as you can tell, Jax and Vera do not have jobs. And that's possibly because they're vampires and they can't be out in the sunlight, but... Oh, and also I can give them infinite money without having to have a job. Let's... Uh-oh. Okay. Come on, Vera, where are ya? Let's zoom out so that the baby's crying gets quieter, because that was loud. Okay, um, so yeah, one of them needs a job. I need to look at their traits first, though. Their vampire traits, specifically. What do you got for your vampire powers? Did I give you sun immunity? Oh, sun resistance. Okay, I need a few more PowerPoints. And they have no weaknesses, because I took those away, too. Oh, what's that? Plasma fruit. Hello. I've never seen that before. I need to get them some more PowerPoints. How do I do that again? Is there a cheat for it? Because if there is one, I'm going to use it. Because unlike most games, you're actually supposed to use cheats in The Sims 4. As a matter of fact, I specifically encoded a cheat bar for you to type in the cheat codes with, and they have cheat codes on the official website for the game. Let's see.
Okay, so I'm going to do this and see if it works. Need to do that one more time. And then I can get the other Now I can do that again. Right, I need to take the weaknesses. But don't worry guys, because I can solve this with another cheat. Oops. I forgot that that was a thing. Okay. Did I do it? Did I do the thing? I don't know if I did the thing. Nope, he still has them. Okay. Um ba -ba 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 -ba. There we go. That should have done it. Or not. Okay. 
do I not have? these two up, shall we? Then <laughs> you get to each other. Make them let's make them independent. Let's make her charm. Now let's take a look at Now let's take a look at them in the Ooh boy, that outfit though. Let's go to the Create a Sim page and see what we can do about those outfits. I won't change anything about their physical traits because they need to stay true to their genetics. But I will change their outfits because that is kind of cringeworthy. I do not like the auto pick for their outfits. I like the music in this page too. It's cool. Let's turn it down a bit though. I don't know if that'll turn it down for you guys, but let's look at the styled looks for these guys. Oh, that's adorable! <laughs> hmm. her dad's eyes, as does her older sister. And to go with that, I think I'll put her in mainly blue. Oh, 
that's an adorable little onesie. That's so cute. But yeah, I think I'll put her in mainly blue. Okay, so. Yeah. What is this thing? Ah, <laughs> uh, not that. I don't like that. But that I could live with, maybe. Let's see if I find anything else that would look nice on her. Not that that's easy to do in this game, because, I mean, the Sims are kind of almost in that uncanny valley, especially the toddlers with those eyes. Like, dear god, I'm tempted to change her eye color just for the time being, so she looks less like a demon child. <laughs> but, I mean, she is a vampire, so... Yeah. Hmm. I almost feel like that makes her look too masculine. that. The color scheme for it, anyways. put her in a skirt, but... I don't think either either one of these things would look too good with her outfit, to be honest. With her shirt, I mean. I mean, I could do that one. But that's... That's a little bit too... Royal blue. And her top is more of like a dark navyish teal color with some yellow detailing on it. So like, <laughs> time to just do this black one, maybe a black skirt. Nah. Yeah. What about this one? <laughs> Maybe these ones instead. That is way too casual. Never mind. Um, we'll just go with these then. Unless. Yeah, and the gray color. Now for her formal outfit, I'm definitely going to be putting her in a dress of some kind. Oh, I like this one. It's cute. I think that's like Chinese or something. I could be wrong, but I think that's Chinese. Or at least like it's inspired by Chinese looks. Oh, now that is just adorable. Yep, that's her outfit. Should I give her any accessories for her formal outfit, guys? I mean, not that she has much in the way of options here, but... Hmm... 
Yeah, are there any necklaces that I can put on her? No, it doesn't look like it. She just got sunglasses, and that's not gonna work. Well, actually, maybe. Let's see what colors we got here. Do the white ones. <laughs> Let's add a cute little hat to this whole ordeal. Since she has like no hair. <laughs> Poor Blakely. Sorry, girl. <laughs> I kind of. Okay, so let's see what they got for their auto spawn. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. I you know, I actually kinda like that shirt. However, are there bottoms to go with it? No, it doesn't look like it, but we can work with this. Oh my gosh. So cute. Oh my god. <laughs> I still want to dress her in mainly blue, so let's look at that top again. minute. That's what that look- Oh my god, that's adorable! I didn't know that that thing had a- Okay. Look, oh, she can be a little moo cow! So cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Now what does this do? Does it put them... Okay. That's kind of a cool diaper, I'm not gonna lie. See, I had never put the baby sims or toddler sims in that kind of... in that outfit before because I thought it would make their skin blue and turn them into an alien, but it did. And I actually kind of like it, it's cute. I don't know how entertaining this is for all you guys who watch my channel, but I'm kind of enjoying myself here. And I think I'm actually talking a lot more than I usually do in my videos that I just record or in my live streams just in general. Because, I mean, I'm not doing anything that requires me to focus too much. Or at least, I don't have to focus enough to where I can't talk or I won't, like, succeed. <laughs> Coffee from my favorite mug. I won't show you the other side, though, because uh, people judge. But yeah, let's see, what pajamas do I want to put her in? I think I'm just gonna go with like... One of these. Or no, I'll just... I'll use the paint splatters this time. And then just put her in like... I actually kind of like the pajamas that they auto-chose. That's not something that happens very often. But those PJs were really cute. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. 
Okay, I think I'll have this be her party outfit, but I want to choose a different color. Ooh, I like this one. That's cute! She's got little planets on her! It's adorable! And then her little... I don't know what you'd call that, but that's like an auto accessory, but not. You know what I mean? Let's change her shoes. Ooh, the shoes. That's what I didn't look at. For her everyday outfit, I don't think... I don't think I like the idea of her wearing, like, those formal-looking shoes, but for her formal outfit, that's fine. Okay, sleep, she has no shoes. Party- her party outfit, I think I'd like for her to wear the formal shoes, too. I think I'll do the yellow ones, though, actually, because I want to add some color to her outfit, but, yeah. like, not go overboard <laughs> with it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Now let's put, let's put some sunglasses on her again, because, again, we need to... What color does she not have enough of? I think I'll do these ones. That's cute. Linda's that have a hat. Cute. <laughs> Except I think I'll go with the black one, actually. And then the yellow. Ooh, that's a little bit bright. That's a little bit bright, sunny boy. I gotta admit, it's kind of cute. Now for the hat. Let's see what colors we got for the hat. Yeah. <laughs> Should we do white for the hat like we did with the other outfit? Nah. I think I actually will go with the blue. Just to kind of help tie the outfit together a bit better, because I think if we put the black one on her, it's gonna be a bit too much, because, like, there's already a lot of black on her clothes, as it is. I mean, there's a lot of blue on her outfit, too, but... Yeah. It's a lot less noticeable than the black. Gotta find that balance, you know what I mean? I'm in no way a fashion expert. I would try to be, but I would fail. looks for swimwear. Oh my goodness. Okay, except for the hat. Except for the hat, I really like that. Because that is so cute. I mean, look at the little floaties on her arms. That is just too adorable. 
I just wish there was more blue. Ooh, that's not as cute though. I think I actually like that. Yeah, I like that a lot better. Okay, and then for her hot weather outfit, let's go with this guy. Cause that's pretty cute. Um, and then her shoes. Oh, did she have shoes with her swimsuit? No, okay, good. I keep forgetting to check that. <sighs> Guys, I am losing my mind. Let's look at the shoes for here. All oh, these little tiger stripes. Yeah. That's adorable. <laughs> okay, now let's go to the cold weather. I do not like that sweater on her. Especially since it's not primarily blue, it's primarily pink. I think I want to go with this one. Is that cold weather oriented at all? I don't understand. Yeah, yeah I think I'll just go with that. I think I'll make the pants black just to match this a bit better. And then she needs a little hat. Oof. But these hats are not the greatest options in the world, but that's okay. Okay, so now let's do her brother next. Now, Vlad has his mother's eyes and hair, whereas Blakely looks more like her dad. They both seem to have more of a mix between their parents' skin tones, just like their older siblings do. Actually, I lied. Their older sister, Onyx, has very much her dad's skin tone. Whereas their older brother has a skin tone that's more towards, that's leaning more towards their mother's. But these two seem to have a pretty even mix between their father and mother's skin tones. But as far as their faces go, Vlad looks a lot more like his mom and Blakely looks a lot more like her dad. Okay, so let's start looking at outfits here. That's adorable. But I think I want to... I want to put him in more red than anything else because of the fact that he... Okay, now without the hat and the glasses. Because he doesn't need those. That is adorable. Okay, I like that. I like that a lot. Now let's see about his formal outfit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at his cute little suit. Oh my goodness. 
That is so cute. I don't understand why the toddler suit has shorts instead of pants, though. Like, he would look even more like an adorable little man if those uh, pants... Like, if those shorts were pants instead of shorts. He's taking a lot less time than his sister did. But... That's because unlike his sister, he's actually supposed to have no hair. So I don't have to pick out the hat as well as the outfit. Let's see here. That's cute. Okay, but let's not do Christmas outfits. Yeah. <laughs> let's do the horses, because why not? Also, it's the only red <laughs> pair of pajamas that is available to choose. Now for his party clothes, I definitely do not like that. Yeah. <laughs> that could be cute though. <laughs> now let's see, is there an option to make that red? at all. Does not look yeah. like it, so I guess I'll have to... I'll go with that. Nope, I like the black ones. And then I'll use those. Because I don't need to have formal shoes when they're going to a party. They just need to look nicer. Not that I ever send my sims to parties anyways, because I'm just boring that way. I mainly just use this to create sims and have them have families. Um, remind me next time if you guys like this um, to show you the other families that I created. Because a couple of my families are meant to represent um, actual people in my life. So I think it'd be cool to let you guys have the opportunity to see that. Oh, I like that, that's cute. Okay. Hot weather. Let's look at the styled looks. <laughs> okay, that would look a lot cuter on his sister. But I like the way the cow shirt looks, because that's just adorable. I think I will keep him in the cow shirt, but I'll change his shoe color because that is not going to work for hot weather. Okay, now for his cold weather outfit. That is not it. Yeah. <laughs> That's not it, Captain. No, sir. 
up, I'm going to put you in the red panda one. And then for your pants, I'm going to change the color of those to black. Boop! There we go. And then... I kind of want to change his shoe color to red just to have more of a balanced looking outfit. There we go. And then I'm going to add a hat on his head. Because it's winter time and hats are, ne are a necessity. There we go. Okay, now that we have those outfits in place, let's switch them to their everyday outfits, which are freaking adorable. I think I do actually want to change her hairstyle a little bit. I think I want to put her in the pigtails. That looks much better. And then you can actually see hair underneath her hat. See, that looks much better. Except in that picture. In that picture, you can't see her hair at all. Even though she has bangs that are supposed to go down to her eyeballs. But either way. That looks much better. Okay. Finish my coffee, I'm sad. You know, I almost want to get more, and then I realize I'd regret that. I would regret that, like, instantly. <laughs> oh my goodness. have I been recording for, I wonder? Hold on a second while this loads. Oh, it's been 48 minutes already? Dang. It certainly does not feel like it's been 38 minutes, and my- I think my computer's clock is a little bit off. It's a wee bit too fast. By like, three and a half minutes. <laughs> Oh, uh, come on, Blakely, you're already making a mess, girl. Shalbo. Marlene Yorin. Turful, turful, not. Karaja Yabasani. Trim. Trim the shoes in. Garifanash. Huh. Noosh Dambalea. Widava. Spekluna Bull. Okay. Frinka Show. So, Blakely. I'm glad our toddlers now, they're going to need their own toddler bed, so I should probably sell their um, bassinets. Trimmer. 
300 dollars doll hairs okay now I need to find space for them to sleep I mean their parents room is huge I could always just put their beds in here I think that's what I'll do. Okay. Say what now? <laughs> oh, this is so okay. It's basically a toilet. Gotcha. I need a toddler bed. Where's Blakely's bed? And then, here's Vlad's bed. Ooh, my voice is all kinds of like raspy and stuff. Ooh, sorry guys. He's gonna be tucked into this little corner here because he likes the darkness. Because he be dark child. While Blakely is gonna be situated in this little corner over here. I'm gonna have them staying in their parents' room for the time being. Wait a minute, I never noticed this over here. Is this so they can observe the household? That's kinda cool! Alrighty then, now that they're all situated. Oh, they need food. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, 
Lumopsy. Luma. Oh, 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 Alright, so let's... Let's get him to grab that. And now let's get her... To brighten his day. Oh my goodness. Stretch the legs, stretch the legs. I think that after this. Wait a minute, what is their... What are they doing? What's your inventory, man? Oh yeah, you have plasma fruit. What happens if you eat one? I wonder. Barovi sends in Gorge Fariki. Hulk of Free, Salvo, Cranny, Yorin. I'd rather test it on him first. Oh! Kirasha, Yavasani, Lymphy, Nu. Oh, I see. They meant plasma as in blood plasma, not plasma as in, like, the element. Gotcha. Rubara, the How's your thirst doing, bro? It has not gotten any better. Okay, let's do that then. Let's go cheat need, because apparently that plasma fruit ain't helping you any. Bless me. <laughs> okay, let's see here. What's that little dance you're doing there, Vlad? Yeah, I kind of stole this house from, uh... I kind of stole this house from the... I think, leader of the vampires? Or a vampire elder, rather? I kind of evicted him so I could move this family in. Because <laughs> they needed a big house. You know, let me actually give them more money real quick. Let's see. The max amount of money you can have in this game, um, 
in any one household is 9,999,999. You can't reach 10 million for some reason. But still, you can become a millionaire rather quickly just by typing in the money cheat. You don't even need a job. But I'm still going to give them one. I'll give him... Oh yeah, but he needs the... He needs the perfect sun resistance first. There we go. Okay, so let's see. I need to send my deed. Now this is going to take me a bit to copy down, so pardon me while I do that. Seven nine four six one four seven four six nine zero zero nine three zero nine six three. There we go, that should have worked. Let's see. Boom! There we go. Now I'm going to give him some more PowerPoints as well so that I can give him the max 
like so I can make him immune to the sunlight so she can or so he can get a job. Oh, and I also made um I also made Onyx a witch. Oh look, one of the people that I uh, bit is now turning. Nice. I always find it kind of amusing when that happens. <laughs> You're a vampire now. <laughs> what? Why are you angry? Oh, someone's trying to teach you how to talk again. And you're about to throw a temper tantrum. Gosh of ribs. Gorb, huh? Schwabi from Fanage. Okay, what was I doing again? Oh, yes. Set. Oops. There we go, now we're gonna make him immune to the sun. Boop! And then I gotta pick five random weaknesses that I'm gonna get rid of here in a second. Now he should have no weaknesses and all the perks. Sweetness, okay, now. Now I can let him get a job. And I think I'm gonna give him one of the new careers that I added. Are you Jax? Mm -hmm. Don't let me pick a career for you yet. Thank you. Okay, now let's try conservationist. Now that only plays. That only pays. Uh, Critic. $21 an hour. That's not bad. Oof. Psychologist only gets three dollars. Oh boy. Or three simoleons, rather, per hour. I think I'll have him be a critic. Yeah, he's going to be a critic. <laughs> 
writing skill. Okay, let's look at the... I need the skills cheats. Let's see here. Dancing, charisma, comedy, fitness. I need writing. There it is. Ah, I forgot. Boop. Set, dot. Set. Onyx is both a vampire and a witch, so which is interesting. I kind of thought I'd test out that combination. She mostly has, like, she still has the thirst and the vampire energy thing as well. But purple She also has witch powers. Now I wonder if there's a way to increase like witch skills. That what this is? A realm of magic? <laughs> okay, so let's try this. Ah! I got to click on the thing. Set. Set. Stat. Uh, 
That's all you think about. Who got a rope on the door? Squad Belcher. Mind you, Jesus. That's a shark. <laughs> Is this not the realm of magic? Why is she angry? Oh, because she's hungry and tired. Drift swing. It ain't. it to main menu. Yes, save and exit. Because I want to see which... I don't know if I have the Realm of Magic pack. Expansion pack, really? Okay, so yeah, that's what I don't. Okay, so what is it that I do have? Is that a. Is that one of my mods? Let me look at my mods. 
The mortal trait. I have the witch trait. These scripts need to stay here. Okay. Okay, so... So it isn't the Realm of Magic expansion pack, or er, game pack that I have. Gotcha, gotcha. I should probably get that. So I can't use any of the Realm of Magic sheets. That's fine! What I can do is I can make a Sim pregnant just by using a cheat, I think. I should be use should be able to use the pregnancy cheats. this video here for now so thank you everybody for watching and if you liked the video I would like you to just hit that like button down below smash it into a million itty bitty pieces and I will see all you guys in my next video or live stream or whatever I do <laughs> bye bye now